You don't mind Rupert sharing a bit of your cake now. Do you watch you? out. He'll grow too fat to fit your pocket. I have a pony too. Oh. He isn't really mine. He belongs to Miles. Miles is my brother, you know. He's away at school. They're my friends. They know me. They trust me. They don't know you. And anyway, visitors aren't allowed out of the compound without a ranger along. My father's used to that. Your father? I'm Tina Bullet. You've got to promise not to tell anyone I'm here. Not even your mother. All right. I promise. Got to be an oath. A blood oath. A blood oath? That way I can really trust you. Then I'll help you all I can. Mother? Hmm? Daddy, he wouldn't let people do something. Would he, if he knew it was wrong? No, baby, he wouldn't. Now, hold still. Are you looking for anyone? I believe they've all gone home. You haven't. How did you get in? I lied to the guard. Why? I'm obsessive. I lie to guards. It's not very serious. I love TV, even when it's terrible. What are you doing out here? If you must know, I'm waiting for a gentleman friend. Come off it. You're not old enough. I'm nearly 15. When was your birthday? April. That was last month. You're only just 14. She wouldn't answer. What? Mother wouldn't answer. What do you mean? I tried and tried. She didn't speak to me. Mother wasn't there. So I had to pretend I, I lied to you. Who are you? What do you want? Lloyd is the creme de la creme, or Mr. Lowther? Neither. It's us. Little girls, if you will only listen to me, I will make of you the creme de la creme. <laughs> <laughs> Annie. It's been many a long day, Davy. You must have grown a foot. I can't deny you. have got a pickle more meat on your bones. Davy, there's a proclamation already in the village. Go back. Go back to the army. Kathy, San Luther? It's, it's Miles. No, it's no further than we did yesterday. It's, it's nowhere if we want to stop. Oh, there are bound to be a few places not marked. Okay, if you say so. Well, come on. We're not going to see much of the country sitting here. I've been thinking, Frank. Those two men that hired you for this job, don't you think some of the questions they asked were kind of weird? What questions? Well, like whether either of us were atheist. So what about it? I just don't think it was any of their business, that's all. Oh, no, it's a high altitude code. I fly high altitude all the hey, time. Hey, hey! So you're the one that won the war. I hope I didn't disturb you. It's just that I'm concerned for you coming into this pest hole. Yes, I understand. I wonder if you do. Why didn't you stop? Why for? The girl was pregnant. So? So she wanted something, Jack. Maybe they were in trouble. You can wait. We'll pick them up on the way back. You don't care about anybody but yourself, do you? Is that what you think of me? I think you're the most selfish man I know. <laughs>